Well, that was by far the most frustrating thing I have ever experienced. Hi, friends. Welcome in. It's PNG tuber me. But that's okay. How are you? Hello, Peachy. Hello, Ash. Hello, Hufflepuff. Hello, Susan. Hello, Taco. How are you guys today? I decided that as the evening... Ah, Ash! Oh my gosh. Another Twitch baby. And the best nine months ever. Love you, love you. Oh, I love you too, Ash. Thank you so much for the nine months. Holy cow. And another Twitch baby. I don't know. I don't know how I'm going to afford uh, child support at this point. How's everybody doing? Hello. Okay. So we do have a couple of channel additions today. If you would proceed towards your, um, girl, you've got a lot of babies. I do got a lot of babies. I really do. You should. What? Well, I'll change that, but you should be able to check in. You can check in for stream. If you do command chillin, it'll tell you how much, how chill you are today. Also, if you do command pizza, it'll tell you. What kind of pizza you ordered? <laughs> I'll need to fix that uh, Space Ranger one though. So, <laughs> Ash is 12% chilling today. Hufflepuff is 73% chilling today. Susan is 50% chilling today. I like to hear that. Ash got a pizza, they ordered chicken Alfredo pizza. Alfredo sauce base with grilled chicken, tomato, and fresh mushrooms. Sounds delicious. Except for the mushrooms. <laughs> Mine is accurate, accurate as I'm actually cold. No. No, no, no. Taco's 25% chilling today. I did a little bit of um, work with the Mix It Up bot. I'm clearly still very new at it. So, um, bear with me. <laughs> there are tons of crazy pizza. Hufflepuff got a flavor, a flavorful vegetarian pizza. Banana pepper rings, jalapenos, black olives, red peppers and onion topped with feta and shredded Parmesan cheese. Oh my God, that sounds good. Susan, Susan got a BLT pizza. Bacon, tomato, lettuce drizzled with homemade ranch. Oh my gosh. Neon, hello friend, welcome in. They ordered a Philly Steak Supreme Pizza. Oh my God, that sounds delicious. Ladybugs, hello friend, welcome in. It is so good to see you. Amybug, hello, it is so good to see you. How have you been? I feel like it's been forever. Listen, y'all, I had every intention of doing a face cam stream today, but as the day went on, I was like, I can't, I can't be seen today. I also ran out of time to like wash my hair. So, um, you know, I was like, you know what, we'll do PNG, PNG stream today. We'll do our Timu haul tomorrow, which I'm really excited for. Cali Cat, hello friend, it is so good to see you. Welcome in. Cali Cat got a smokehouse barbecue pizza. Sweet Baby Ray's barbecue sauce topped with pulled pork. Cheese blend, onions and bacon. Oh my god! All this command does is make me hungry. I mean, Hufflepuff. Is it? Is it a? Is it a Kayla stream? Um, if it doesn't make you a little bit hungry, <laughs> I've been obsessed with looking at Timu. Um, me too. I got two bags today, and I think I've got like two more that are still coming <laughs> because I I can't I can't um. I can't uh, contain myself. I feel like that too. Though I got COVID three days ago, finally starting to feel a little bit. Oh no, Amy, but you got COVID. Well, I hope that you start to feel better, friend. Um, and it is so good to see you. I wonder, is this stuff like actually good quality? I'm nervous to place an order. So Hufflepuff, um, everything that I, full transparency. I did open, I did open 
the package a little bit and I pulled out a couple of things and it seems like it's pretty decent um, quality so we'll see we'll see um, I did get myself some pajamas so we'll uh, we'll see if they fit <laughs> wish I could use that avatar thing for my work meetings <laughs> true I know right so um, we are gonna stream for a little bit today I'm not I'm not entirely sure what's going on with Robert I'm supposed to pick him up at some point possibly from horseshoes because also I didn't want to see you, you to see me yawn a million times um, he wants to have a few adult beverages this evening so um, he wanted me to pick him up but I don't know what's going on. I don't know. I know nothing anymore. But we'll play some Dreamlight Valley for a little while today. Uh, tomorrow, what are we doing tomorrow? Speedstorm. We'll do some open lobbies and Speedstorm tomorrow. Um, but yeah, how was everybody's weekend? How was everybody's Mondays? Um, it feels a little weird to be here on a Monday. Not gonna lie. But you know what? We might we might make it a, a regular thing. <laughs> Ooh, Speedstorm is so fun. I know, Hufflepuff. I've been obsessed with playing it. Um, so we're definitely going to be... Uh, we're definitely going to be uh, uh, doing it tomorrow. We're going to do some open lobbies, kind of open it up for everybody. All right. Let's go find Buzz. It did save after we played it last, you guys. Oh, my gosh. I still can't believe I didn't. We raided, and then I was like, I am so tired, I'm ready for bed, that I just, like, logged out, and I didn't save anything. And I was like, no, instant regret. Thankfully, though, thankfully, though, God, he moves fast. I think it saves when you hit exit. Oh, any bug. I, it's looking like that's what happened, and I'm very happy about it, so... <laughs> but I was like, no. I haven't played since last time you streamed it because I don't have anyone else to play with yet. Well, Hufflepuff, anytime we're we're off stream and you feel like playing, just just um just let me know. Maybe we can hook up and we'll play some a few rounds. <laughs> Oh God. Because it does the same simple that the save is. Okay. Okay, that makes me feel good. But it was still like a, like a panic moment. I was like, no, 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 no. Uh, okay. Let's see. We're gonna find some aliens today, maybe. Oh my gosh, we're gonna go see, um, we're going to see the Guardians of the Galaxy movie on Thursday, and I am not like mentally or emotionally prepared for what's to come. I've, I've avoided spoilers so far, but I've heard it's very emotional and I am not, I am not looking forward to it. <laughs> I'm jealous. Oh, Hufflepuff. Too bad you don't live closer. You could have come, you could have come with us. That'd have been fun. Stream party at the movies to see a Marvel movie. That would be ideal. <laughs> okay. So we found one. I'm sad that I've missed like four days of Scrooge's shop. Sorry. Lost my star path. Oh, Amy Bug. Well, luckily, I know that is a. Speaking of Scrooge's shop, we should go in there while, uh, while we're up here. Um, luckily, there's still a few days left, right? I'm not even, I'm not done with it either. <laughs> I'd be so down, me too. 
Was that a waterfall? <gasps> Stephanie! Key friends. Key friends! <laughs> Becky, girl. Come on. Um, I have never seen this before in my life in this game and I need it. Get out of the way, Mirabelle. He friends. That's how I'm gonna start. He friends. <laughs> Thank you so much for those bits, Stephanie. Welcome in. How are you? <laughs> but I may go see the live action Little Mermaid in theaters. Yeah, we're going to also see that. Um, we're going to go see it, and then we might take Nissa to go see it, too. Like, when they... Hopefully, they'll do, like, a sensory screening. So, like, the lights will be up and the volume will be down. Um, that way, it's a little bit easier on her little ears. <laughs> he friends. I love it. Is this a headband? Is this a headband? <gasps> what? Why do I have two watches in my shop today? Ugh. Sorry, Moana. I think I already have that. Flounder looks scary, but other than that, I'm super excited for the Little Mermaid live action. So... I thought Sebastian looked a little, a little creepy, personally. Seriously, why did they make him flat? <laughs> I know, I was hoping that they'd make him like a, he'd make him a little round boy. I'm so pumped for Sebastian because I love David Diggs. So I think he's going to do a wonderful job. He just freaks me out. He's just a little scary. I literally don't like anything else in here. Uh, be our guest, be our guest, put our service to the test. Why is this jacket $4,000? I'm gonna buy it. So we're gonna close our eyes when Flounder and Sebastian come out. Exactly. <laughs> but I'm super excited. Um, the music sounds wonderful. Oh my gosh, I got that first look at... Um, hold on a second, guys. Robert's calling me. Hello? Oh, that's fine. Yeah. I love you too. Bye. Love you. Bye. Why is it 4000 I'll buy it. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> Booked a super last minute trip to Disney the other night and I heard they will be doing character meet and greets with the new Ariel. <gasps> Ash, really? That's amazing. And Donkia, hello, friend. Welcome in. How is it going? How is your Monday? Okay. But also don't 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 judge me because like 4000 coins may not be realistic, but that that jacket was kind of cool. I hope it starts while I'm there. Yes. I hope so too. And if you do can take pictures, please take pictures. The new Ariel is gorgeous. I know. Halle Bailey. Oh, I love her. So, like, is it an alien a day in someone's house, or what? Doing good, thank you. Did I miss the Timu, Timu Hall? Donkia, no. So I... <laughs> I changed my mind. I had every... I had every intention of doing the Timu Hall today. Um, but as the day went on, and I ran out of time to once I got off work and made dinner and Nissa got home and Nissa and I played and hung out I just I didn't have enough time to wash my hair 
and I'm like, I don't, it looks like I stuck my head in like a grease trap. It's so gross. And it takes me a while to like, believe it or not, I don't have a lot of hair, but no, I was too slow. Um, I was like, I, I don't have the energy to shower. And then I'd have to blow dry my hair before stream. And I just, yeah, I was like, you know what? No, no. We're going to do the Timu haul tomorrow, though. I got two big bags, and I think I've got two more packages on the way. <laughs> I've never found aliens in people's houses. Stephanie, really? Wait, the little green men are in the game now? Ash! Yes, they're part of a bu Buzz's quest. They're not, like, major characters, like, yet. But you have to go and, like, find them. The claw. <laughs> My hair on the daily donkey. It is so bad. Like when people are like, oh, I go three or four days without washing my hair. I'm like, I could never. I could never go three or four days without washing my hair. And like dry shampoo does nothing for me. It just makes the problem worse. You may not be on that part of the quest yet. Oh, I didn't. Oh, yeah. I never figured that out because I don't have Buzz yet. Oh, no. <laughs> Where the heck have I been? Under a rock, apparently. Ash, it's okay. It's okay. I can go two at most. My max is three days. That's it. Oh. I know. Some people are like, oh, I wash my hair every sixth day. And I'm like, what? What is that like? What is it like? And Mariah, hello friend. Welcome man. it is so good to see you. Happy Monday. Um, yeah, so you can do your daily Space Ranger check-in. I do have to adjust it a little bit, but it should update. Um, it should update when I update mix it up the next time. I have really fine hair is it's just it's just a struggle I can't use yeah my hair is really fine too I have to wash my hair every other day Ash I'm, I'm right there with you oh yeah that ain't me <laughs> Space Ranger Stephanie is reporting for duty man that would have been really cute if it had worked I must have typed something wrong don't forget there is a couple of new commands too for those of you who have done not done it, it's exclamation point chillin and exclamation point pizza. I've been working on some other ones, but they're kind of time consuming. Honestly. Mariah got a ordered a good old pepperoni pizza. <laughs> Any bug got a Chicken artichoke pizza. Oh my god, that sounds so good. Stephanie is 36% chillin. Mariah is 84% chillin today. Nice, nice. Donkia got a cheesy chicken buffalo ranch pizza. Oh my god, they all sound so good. My pizza is way too much. Really, Donkia? No! <laughs> I think it sounds delicious. I'm losing my marbles. No, I am so sorry. Is there anything we can do to help? I would love to find a little green alien in this thing. Okay, bye. Anybug is 77% chilling today. I don't even know what I'm at. Let me see. What is going on here? Hello? I had pizza for dinner. That's good because if I didn't, I'd be craving. <laughs> I got a spicy Italian pizza. Oh my God, that sounds good. 59% chillin' today. <laughs> I want that one. It does sound really good, doesn't it? <laughs> So my mom had Nissa today. 
well, my mom had Nissa last night and I video chatted with her this morning on my first break and Italian dressing base, like instead of sauce. Yes. Doesn't that sound good? I think that sounds delicious. <laughs> Um, so I call her and I video chat with her and she goes, Nissa, Nissa, come home. I come home, mama. I come home. And I'm like, oh, honey, you can't come home yet. It sounds good, but also like heartburn central. That is also true. I'll be taking my Tums while I eat that. <laughs> And I was like, no, you're gonna, you'll be okay, honey. You'll be okay. And this, I come home, mama. I come home. And she freaked out. So I, I was able to get, finally get her off the phone because I had to go back to work. So then I like, I call her on my lunch just to check in, make sure she's doing okay. And she goes, oh, I come home, mama. I, I come home now. I almost told my mom, I was like, you better bring that girl home. You better bring that child home right now. <laughs> I was like, you get, you'll get to come home. I was like, why don't you have some ice cream with Mimi? And then, and then you can come home and then we'll have all the snuggles. Luckily the ice cream bribe worked. <laughs> oh, you want to hear something else that's funny that happened to me today? So today was my first day back at my, in my regular department at work, right? Not a fan of grandma's Amy, but I don't know because she had, because she had that double ear infection. I don't know if maybe she was just, she just wanted to be someplace comfortable and wanted to be home. So, um, could be that, but she was fine. Once ice cream works for me too, as a bribe, I know. Same. <laughs> so I work, I started, I start back in my, my regular department today. I worked in the department for a total of an hour and a half before they pulled me back over to the fam, back to family medicine where I just was and am miserable. And there were at some at one point today there was 75 phone calls in queue. And I wanted to ask them why that was my problem. You know, you moved me back to my department. Why is that my problem? You know? <laughs> I was so mad. I was so so mad. Ursula, stop sleeping. I'm all about that ice cream. I got a ninja, a ninja cream, ninja creamy, and we made peaches and cream ice cream. Oh my gosh, that sounds delicious, Donkia. Oh my God. Was that expensive? What department do you normally work, if I can ask? Yeah, Hufflepuff, so I normally work with in the pediatric department. So I work with all the pediatricians offices. And it's not nearly as terrible as family med. Don't get me wrong. It definitely has its stressful day, like days, but every day in family medicine is stressful. I, I was like, man, if we could make our own ice cream, we'd probably save so much money. We've gotten cold stone twice in like a week. So <laughs> we need to do something. <laughs> The one I got around Black Friday, I think, was 150. Look them up on TikTok. So many recipes. Oh, my gosh. Black Friday really is a great time to get items like that. Mariah, you can, you can get them at Sam's Club? Oh, my God. Oh, yeah. Yeah, okay. Yeah, that makes sense. Yeah. I much prefer pediatrics. <laughs> See, I think I can handle pediatrics a little bit better just because I can sympathize with parents, you know? Not that people 
that work in the department, you know, they can't, but sometimes, sometimes those older people, they're just so mean. They're so mean. <laughs> I can't tell you how many times an old person has called me a dumb bee. I've never had a parent of a child patient call me a dumb bee. <laughs> and they come for you in every way too. I know. Well, today I had a lady ask me if I was if I was incompetent. Because I was asking questions that I'm supposed to ask, you know? Are you incompetent at your job? Like, come on! I'm just... I'm trying to keep your information safe. So please, just let me do my job. <laughs> I froze a literal can of mangoes with some juice and made a sorbet. Oh my god, that sounds so delicious oh my god that sounds so good <laughs> um I'm lost whoa how did I not know you could go up that way <laughs> honestly I could picture my grandpa talking to people that way it's so sad it's terrible it's absolutely terrible. People are unbelievable. I know. It's just like, come on. <laughs> I'm just trying to do my job. Or the people who call and they think they know how our job works. Well, I had someone tell me, well, honestly, obviously you weren't smart enough to get a real job. Like, what? Did you really just say that to me? Come on. I want to see you last more than 10 minutes doing what I do. <laughs> I know, I'm gonna have to look at that Sam's Club too this weekend. I think we might get one. Oh my gosh, hold on guys. Nissa's screaming for me. I'll be right back. <laughs> Okay, I'm back. She's fine. She just, she was being a toddler. Anyways. <laughs> My dad's that way. I try to tell him to like chill on people on the phone. I just, I like, I used to like to say, I'd like to see, I'd like for these people to talk to me like this to my face, but unfortunately <laughs> in this day and age, they probably would because people just are not nice. <laughs> I've had someone say the real job thing to me too. I just don't understand. I just, I don't get it. Like, why are you so mean? Why you gotta be so rude? <laughs> What the hell? Oh my god, I know, Mariah, it's terrible. I could not deal with it. Amy Bug, it's awful. I don't know how people in customer service do it. All the love to those who work in the service. Me, I give you guys all the props, too. I go through it, um, especially those that do it, like, face-to-face. -face. I don't think I could ever do face-to-face -face retail ever again. I just don't think I could. I couldn't. No. <laughs> They do it to your face too. Retail customers are brutal. Ah, uh, yeah. Hey, Addie! Oh my gosh! Welcome in, friend! It is 
so good to see you. How have you been? Hello. My dad Deb talks to me like that too. My face, he's not scared to be a jerk. Oh, Donkey, I'm so sorry. That's terrible. I have the nastiest old women say things to me. I just don't understand. Like, what do they think? What do they think they're going to accomplish by being rude to you? You know? I really think everybody needs to have a job in customer service for at least six months to show how people can be. It made me appreciate workers so much more. I agree, Hufflepuff. I agree. A thousand percent. And mom of three, welcome in. It is so good to see you. Hello. I know it's not my face today, but we're still here hanging out. Hold on a moment. Robert's home and he's just very excited. <laughs> I've been busy, but took my last final this morning. So I'm officially done with my first year of vet school. Oh my God, Addie, I am so proud of you. How exciting. Congratulations. <laughs> That's amazing. You hear the dog running around in the background. Robert's home, so he's like, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. <laughs> So has anybody had any, oh, that's cool that that still lasted. I thought that if I like logged out of the game, it wasn't gonna stay fancy anymore. These shrimp are gonna be the death of me. Thanks y'all, it feels so good to be done. Can't wait to play some games again. Addy, that's so exciting. What is the first game you're gonna play? Oh my God, this thing scared me. <laughs> Hi, gonna be lurking. Hope your May 1st is great. Thanks, sunshine. It is so good to see you, friend. I hope that you're doing really well. Um, it's so good to see you. Desi, hello, welcome in. How are you, friend? It is so good to see you. Yes, happy May 1st to everybody. Can you believe it's already May? I can't, absolutely insane. Where did this year go? <laughs> I think bug snacks. I've heard good things about it. Addy, I just downloaded that on our Xbox for, um, cause it was free for a couple more days for the game pass. So I downloaded it, um, to see how it goes. Bella does the same. She goes wild when my husband comes home. I know he sees Robert and it's like, game over nobody else matters nobody else is important <laughs> i know you're your pain kayla those shrimp i can't these shrimp are the worst i'm well desi that's amazing i'm so glad that you're well that is that's amazing i'm so happy for you guys finishing up school just being super awesome humans in general i'm so blessed that you you uh take time out of your schedules in your days to hang out with me. I feel so special. <laughs> I tried bug snacks. Ooh, did you any bug? Did you like it? Is it good? Gonna go eat dinner, but I'll lurk for you. Have a good night, y'all. All right, Hufflepuff sounds so good. Thank you so much for hanging out. It was so good to see you. Um, hopefully we will also see you tomorrow. And I promise we're gonna be doing our Timu haul tomorrow. <laughs> All right, please be a shrimp. Please be a shrimp. Please be a shrimp. Ah! I liked it. I didn't finish it, but it was definitely fun. Ooh, good to know. I'll be, I'll be excited to try it out then. Boom. Boom. No! I'm so. I don't want a swordfish. I don't want a swordfish. I want a shrimp. 
I know they're typically in blue bubbles, but... Wow. I'm terrible at fishing under pressure, apparently. <laughs> I'm all, I'm terrible at this. Terrible. Let me see. I gotta turn on Mrs. Sound Machine. No shrimp since the update. Oh my gosh, really? The only fish I've caught at the beach are the swordfish, herring, kingfish. I think it's a kingfish. Let me see. Wow, it keeps connecting and disconnecting. I think I've caught the five shrimp. That's it. Five shrimp since the update. It's really obnoxious. I just realized I still don't have Prince Eric. Oh my gosh, Ash, really? <laughs> That's so funny. Wait, what is that thing in the water? It's like pink. Oh yeah, so this is, we're not, I'm, I don't know what it is just yet. Um, it's part of N Nala's quest line. So, I just know that, I just know that it's started. It's so pretty, I know. It is so pretty. I wonder, can you fish it? I don't think so. No. <laughs> I think I have to get my, I have to get my, uh... oh my God, I can't think. This is crying. Robert's got it. He's home. <laughs> um. Friendship levels. Oh my gosh. I can't speak. Oh, I did want to mention too. Um, I will let you guys know about Friday's stream. Um. Meezy is doing a, um, <laughs> she wanted water when I put her down. Um, Meezy's doing a charity stream for the Trevor Project on Friday. Um, she's also going to be touring the full, the Island Challenges. And, um, so she's going to need some mods around to help with that, um, that day. Um, so I will let you guys know. I don't know exactly when she'll be finished streaming. Um, but I do have to help her out with that. That way she's got like an extra set of hands and stuff. So um, I'll keep you updated about Friday's stream. Um, if we don't stream on Friday, we'll do like a... We'll do a Saturday stream to make up for it, I think. Um, yeah. I just wanted to throw that out there. <laughs> Anyone have any other good game wrecks, just in case I don't like bug snacks? Um, Addy, Disney Speedstorm is a lot of fun. Um, <laughs> um, and that's a game that we can play in, together in the community. It's like Disney meets Mario Kart. Um, just my, uh, just one of my personal recommendations. <laughs> um, what else have I been playing lately? Um... Coral Island is good, but I think that one's just a PC game. Um, what games do you normally play, Addy? I know that that's a loaded question because you really haven't had time to play. But um, what things do you normally like? I 
I should get Nala and update my um, love friendship level with her, but I think she's asleep. Ugh. I already know how to do this, but I can't, it won't let me get take it out of my inventory. I'm supposed to plant these eggs. Wow, I really didn't do anything, did I? <laughs> I don't even know how to play this game. Ooh, Wildflowers is really good. Um, I've been playing that one in my... Uh, uh, off stream um, although sorry guys um, I haven't played it since the update dropped but um, I've heard good things that one's really good Animal Crossing Disney Dreamlight Valley but kind of got burnt out Stardew Valley cozy games Mm, yes, uh, lemon cake is a lot of fun. Um, it's kind of like, it's kind of like a, uh, uh, uh. Oh my god, you guys! <laughs> I can't speak. What is wrong with me? Boba tea, spinach, and a snowball. Of course, he likes spinach and snowballs but wildfire <laughs> wildflowers for sure is so good I gotta have spinach right I gotta um that's basil, isn't it? Shoot. Shoot. <laughs> I bet it's in my house fridge. That's mint. Uh. Okay. I really want Puff Pals to come out. Um already i didn't get to back it but it looks so cute oh yeah stephanie the animals just came with the new update right i should update it You're telling me I don't have a single spinach? That doesn't seem right. Oh, my, oh there. Woo! I was like, you gotta be kidding me. The one person I wanted to hang out with is asleep, of course. Where's Kristoff? There's Eric. Oh, Kristoff! Um, so I play Wildflowers on my Switch, Addie. I know you're asking Stephanie, but that's where I play mine. <laughs> w Y L D E flowers. Oh, 
Y'all, I've lost it. All the windows are open and I live in a complex. Some dude outside said hi and I meowed hi back. <laughs> I don't know who he is. Oh my God, Stephanie, like a, like meow, like a meow or I don't even know. <laughs> That's so funny. <laughs> I can just see Stephanie. <laughs> just, she just out here meowing at people. <laughs> I can't. I'm crying. That's so funny. Oh my god. <laughs> I would love to know what that guy was thinking after that happened. Was he like, what the hell? <laughs> oh my God. I can't, I can't handle it. I think that's gonna be my response to people now when I don't wanna talk to them, I'm just gonna start meowing at them. <laughs> Just sitting eating my ice cream, meowing at passerby passers by. <laughs> Listen, Stephanie, if we were hanging out, I totally I would have meowed with you. Thankfully I'm on the second floor so they can't see me. <laughs> Maybe he thinks he's going crazy. Like he's hearing phantom meows. <laughs> He's like, oh no, the meowing started again. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, that's so funny. Gray stuff, fish and chips, and a shiny diamond. Uh, I don't think I've made fish and chips. I do think I've made the gray stuff. Hmm. So I am thinking of doing, I know we just did this, re, this like stream rebrand in January. But I do think I want to do something more summery. I think. And I'd love to know, like, what kind of themes are, would you guys think would be interesting? I'm so tired, but if I go to bed now, it'll be like 3 a.m. when I wake up. Oh, Mariah, I am so sorry. Um, so Robert actually went, he left for work at 3.30 this morning. 3.30 this morning because he had, there was a job that needed to go out so he was at work by like 4 a.m. Disgusting. <laughs> Autofill. Okay. Start cooking. If I ever streamed, I think I'd do flowers, bees, and ladybugs. I'd be a little ecosystem. Oh my gosh, Mariah, that is adorable. I love that. That's so cute. That's horrible, I know. And he was like, he was so grouchy when he woke up. Like, he woke me up and he was asking where something was and I was like, what? What are you talking about? Sorry guys, I'm trying to look up this recipe. That is adorable. I know, Amy Bug. That's such a good idea. Okay. I would be too. I'm a complete a-hole when I'm tired. Well, I'm just like, you gotta be kidding me, man. Like, you are, you're doing this voluntarily. 
And then you gotta drag me down with you? Nope. Nope. Undo. I need a potato. I need some canola. A wheat. And a, a, and, a, and a fish. That's another thing. So Robert, I always tell him not to wake me up on the weekends. Especially if Nissa isn't awake. Like, don't wake me up. Please let me sleep. I never really get to sleep in. Okay. Tell me why. Tell me why. He always wakes me the frick up. Always. I'm like, dude... I don't need to be awake. If you're awake, you'll function without me. <laughs> Stephanie, that's my face exactly. And then he's like, I don't understand why you're so mad. You're awake now. And I was like, you don't understand why I'm mad? You woke me up. We've been doing this dance for seven and a half years. I never like to be woken up. <laughs> Joe always wants to be productive at 8 a.m. on the weekends. It's a sin. Ugh. No, thank you. It's like that scene from New Girl when Winston is sleeping and he gets woken up. And he's like, Sundays are for sleeping. <laughs> he's like, if we leave by 7.30, we can make it to Sam's right when they open and then we can hit the other stores. Oh. Oh, no. No, no. <laughs> nope. <laughs> Robert's like, the sky's awake, so I'm awake. <laughs> My dog wakes me up at 630 every single day. No. Why? One time my boyfriend woke me up and I turned over and I went, why? Erg. And I guess he took it personally, but it's like, it's 7 a.m. Why are you waking me up? Exactly. They just don't get it, do they? They don't understand. Okay, Cork. He's in there trying to knock over his food bowl. I honestly don't know where anything is anymore. Oh my gosh. Oh, hello, Meek. Not today, sir. No! Zeus wakes my boyfriend. He knows I won't get up. That's hilarious. Um, the cats always wake me up because I will wake up because just by nature, like ever since this has been born, I'm a very, very, very light sleeper. Um, <laughs> so they always know to mess with me if their food bowl is empty. Elsa would want my shiny diamond. She's extra. Joey always wakes up before me and grabs his blanket off the bed to go sit on the couch. Yes, we sleep in separate blankets. Hey, I'm all about separate blankets too. He's a blanket hog and I am too sweaty to share. But just by him moving his stuff around wakes me up and he says, It's not my fault. Just stay in bed. <laughs> right? Oh, I didn't think. It's like, it's like. Oh, I wasn't being that loud, was I? And you're just like, really? Really? You know exactly what you're doing. Yeah, Robert and I also use separate blankets. But Robert also gets so mad at me because, like, he he's a snuggler. Okay? Don't let him. Don't tell him I told you this. He might be listening, but don't tell him I told you this. He loves to snuggle at bedtime. And I'm just like, please, for the love of God, give me my space. I didn't want to do that. I wanted to talk to Elsa. And sometimes he'll get mad at me. And I'm like, listen, your body heat plus me, like I am just naturally, I'm just a sweaty person, okay? <laughs> I just need my space. Joey tries to sneak his foot under my blanket and I kick him. Oh my God. <laughs> Now, I don't mind, like, I don't mind a foot under the blanket. Fine. Whatever. But, like, I'm sorry. If you're, like, laying across me, I'm not gonna. Yeah. 
No. I'm gonna be upset with you. <laughs> separate blankets, separate beds. I need to starfish. Oh my gosh. So I was talking to Robert. So we think we're gonna be in need of a new mattress in a couple of months. And I was like, why don't we why don't we get a king size bed, but do like a split king? That way we could each have our own beds. He didn't he didn't like that. I thought it was a wonderful idea. <laughs> he did not. <laughs> he was like, I don't think so. I'm like, but we would be so much more comfortable. Those people who, where is Scar? He's over here, of course. Those people who have like separate beds and separate rooms, they're living and get the adjustable base it's a game changer we so we do have we do have an adjustable base and oh my god it is literally the best thing i have ever purchased in my life we got it a couple of years ago um it, it's, it's it's a beautiful thing <laughs> but um yeah these people in separate beds live in separate separate beds separate rooms Ugh. sounds like a dream to me We got a king a few months ago. He's still up my ass. And these cats. I might as well be in a twin. <laughs> a mood. A mood. That's, it. That's why I'm so... I'm so hesitant to get... To let Nissa, like, be able to sleep with us. Because I know that between her and Robert, I will not have any space. Like, you should see the way this girl sleeps at night. The other night... I woke up to check on her and she was so her nugget couch has two it's got like two separate pieces so like you can build stuff with it and we have them stacked right now in the corner like kind of like a bed because she still is kind of scared of her bunk bed so we gave her that as an option to sleep in if she doesn't want to sleep in her bed and she was literally sleeping in between the two pieces of the couch and then I woke up a couple hours later and she's upside down in the middle of it. <laughs> I'm like, there's no way I could sleep with her and Robert at the same time. I would not survive. We have a king, but Zeus lays in the dead middle of the bed, so it feels like I have a twin. Oh, I miss um, our old dog, Biscuit. He was He would always sleep right in the middle of us. He was the best snuggler. Robert would get so mad. He's like, oh, so you can snuggle with the dog, but you can't snuggle with me? <laughs> I'm like, yeah, the dog will move when I ask him to. <laughs> My daughter sleeps with me at times she starfishes. Oh, Doc, yeah, no. I don't think I could do it. I couldn't do it. <laughs> I could. Like, I'm dreading the day she figures out the the per, the child doorknob on her door and she's standing by my bed at 3 a.m. Mommy bed. Mommy sleep with you. <laughs> I say the same thing to Joe. You'll hold Zeus, but not me. He says, I'm too hot, but Zeus has the role for I know. I know. <laughs> He's like, I don't understand. I miss my old dog. She used to lay on my legs, keep my legs and feet warm. Aw, Amy Bug, I know. Our our biscuit was the best boy. He was the best boy for snuggling. I miss him so much. <laughs> Have you tried the hug and roll method from friends, Kayla? <laughs> hug her and then roll her. Um, I have tried that with Robert, but he... he when he is dead weight, he is like impossible to move literally impossible I've tried <laughs> I hope he doesn't hear me say this <laughs> oh Chandler flung me off the bed because he was trying the whole hug and roll thing that Ross does <laughs> is she not having it she doesn't want you to leave then why are you leaving her you better go back in there. She is mad. She missed us. <laughs> P. 
Pick your poison. Ooh, Mariah with a pick your poison card. I love these. I love them. If Robert ends up with a sprained arm, we know why. Yeah, I hug and rolled him right off the bed. <laughs> no, it's me with the wrist injury. <laughs> all right. All right, all right, all right. She is so mad. If he can't get her to calm down, guys, I might have to cut stream early. <laughs> all right. Let's do a pick your poison. Are y'all ready? Oh, these cards are stuck together. Hold on a second. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Here we go. Would you rather have no elbows or be absolutely convinced you're in the center of a conspiracy that isn't true. I'm sorry, but the idea of not having elbows really freaks me out. Anybody else? Oh, you guys would choose no elbows? I'm already crazy enough, Ash. <laughs> No elbows for sure. Everybody's going no elbows. I can't take the mental toll. Oh, that's fair enough. Is it like jelly or just can't bend your arms? I mean, I would I would assume that means like, what does that say about our collective mental health? <laughs> Touche. At least we're all in good company, right? I just, I feel like when it says no elbows, I feel like it would just be jelly. And that's why it freaks me out. No, I think like stick arms. I think it's like you don't have an actual more anxiety or wobbly arms. I know. It's kind of like a lose-lose. At least we could all go to a group home together. <laughs> Yeah, you right. You right. I was thinking like no bend in the elbow. We can bend the wrist. Oh. You know, they'd probably kick us out of out of the group home. We'd be too rowdy. we had that card. I want to do another one. Hold on. <laughs> we need to have our own private one. Oh my gosh. I agree. I agree. <laughs> All right, we're going to do one more. Are you ready? We can open it on our farm. Yes, Mariah. Yes. I love that. Let's do it. It'll really be a funny farm. <laughs> oh, was that too much? Was that too much? Was that not? I thought it was kind of funny. <laughs> and we could register all of the animals. I chuckled. I laughed. Okay. <laughs> Like, you ever have those moments where you say something and then you're like, oh no. That was too much. I thought it was funny though. I'm glad I'm not alone, okay. <laughs> but all of the animals on the farm could be like our therapy animals, right? I'd be down. Our commune. Guess you had to be there. Awkward. <laughs> <laughs> Eat popsicles? What the heck are popsicles? What the heck are popsicles? I 
don't like that. Okay, I guess I should just hang out with... I guess I should just hang out with Buzz. So, can these aliens, for those of you who that have done this, can they spawn at any time or is it like a once a day kind of thing? I want an emotional support goat. That would be amazing, Mariah. Like from Zootopia, yes. The animals would have to be registered emotional support because we'd lose it elsewise. <laughs> No, come on. Let's hang out. Roger that. Goodbye. They're cute. They're little paw print popsicles. <sighs> but how do you make them? She finally mm -hmm. goes down. That's dead. Okay, we're gonna do another pick your poison first. Oh, Ash, Ash redeemed a pick your poison. All right, sounds good to me. Okay, here we go. Here we go. <laughs> Slush fruit sugar cane. Thank you, Stephanie, thank you. <laughs> All right, would you rather Get hit in the cheek by a professional baseball baseball player's fastball, or constantly feel like you're covered in ants. Both sound absolutely awful. <laughs> Ash is like those both sound terrible. <laughs> So break your face or want to rip your skin off? Neither. Well, I mean, you have to. You have to pick one. I don't. I don't know if I could pick one. Do I have any slush? Please. Oh, I do. Thank goodness. Who is paying for the dental surgery afterwards? <laughs> Mariah is, she's coming in with a, <laughs> she's like, okay, if we're going to be rational about this, <laughs> uh, sugar cane and a fruit. I mean, <laughs> you guys, you ha you got to pick one. I'll choose the, the, the secret third option, run away. <laughs> the baseball is one time, but those fast fastballs are like 85 miles per hour. Your face is messed up forever. But, like, can I sue the baseball player for hitting me? If so, I'll be set. That's what I was kind of thinking. Like, if he hits me in the face, like, he would have to pay to fix it, right? Baseball, I guess. <laughs> You're still not convinced. <laughs> but to feel like you get extra money for face scars, yes. I just... To always feel itchy? I don't know. Oh no. <laughs> That's a tough one. I couldn't imagine ants forever. I think that I would I would probably literally go crazy. More so than um than thinking I was at the middle of a conspiracy uh con Po blah, 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 conspiracy theory. <laughs> You'd end up on our farm. Oh, yeah. 
Well, I'm already gonna be there anyways, so. All right, let's make one more of these. I think that's five. This is still my face right now, Ash. That's so funny. <laughs> Neither are great, but that was a good, those are good questions. this one over here I'm gonna eat it one two three four five ash is going for one more all right let's see what we got I need a better one. That was a pretty good one though. That was a pretty good one. All right, let's see. Random, 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 random. Oh God. Oh, this card is already disgusting. Okay. Are you ready? Robert is reading them. Hold on. <laughs> oh my God, you guys. <laughs> okay, here we go. Would you rather have the arms of an infant or eat a dozen raw oysters that have been sitting out in the sun for two days. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> uh, 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 Stephanie, arms of an infant are different than arms of a toddler. Wait, oysters in the sun for how long? Two days. <laughs> Two days. <laughs> Arms of an infant, I guess. Oof, I hate them both. I know, they're both terrible. I probably would also do the arms of an infant. I, I mean, I guess. I suppose. <laughs> Those are, these cards have been really good tonight. I wonder if I can pull another one. This one will be on the house. Don't use your, don't use your points. This one will be on the house. This one was supposed to redeem the terribleness of the last one. How would we type? <laughs> oh my God, Mariah. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Both of these arms situations would be hard to wipe our tissues. That's true. Okay. This is gonna be our last one for the evening and then I am gonna have to go take care of Nissa. She is like having a full blown meltdown. Like she doesn't want Robert. So um, I'm gonna have to go in there and take care of her. But here's the last one. Changing a tampon, oh my God. Oh my god, these are all things that I didn't think of. Yeah, but you would most certainly probably die if you ate oysters that have been sitting out in the sun for two days. I'm just throwing that out there. Eating. <laughs> you can eat with a straw. 
<laughs> okay, here we go. Last pick your poison of the evening. Be unable to distinguish between your dreams and reality or fight a kangaroo with your bare hands. I think I would take my chances and fight a kangaroo with my bare hands. That's what I would pick. That already happens sometimes. Fighting a kangaroo with your bare hands? Oh. <laughs> I was like, Mariah, when did you fight a kangaroo with your bare hands? Dreams in reality? I don't know, that would be crazy scary. Dreams, what's reality anyways? That's true. No, not remembering if something is a dream. <laughs> I was not made to fight anyone, let alone a kangaroo. Their kicks are deadly. Yeah, but what if the kangaroo was like Kangaroo Jack? What? <laughs> yeah, but could you... Could, but could you imagine, like, telling somebody that you fought a kangaroo with your bare hands? I mean, that would be so cool. <laughs> Alrighty, friends. I am going to go ahead and I am going to... Not with my infant arms. Oh, my God. I didn't even think about that. You would have your infant arms. Oh, my God. I'm dying. If you hold their head, they can't kick you. So that's a tip for you. What? If you hold a kangaroo's head, they can't kick you? Shut up. Is that true? That can't be true. No way. I'm Googling that. I've got to Google it. Like at a distance? Yeah. Nuh-uh. Okay, hold on. If you hold... <laughs> Survival tip of the day, Robert said. Did you know if you lift a kangaroo's tail, it can still hop? I can't, I can't find it right now. <laughs> All right, friends. Well, I have had a wonderful night hanging out with you guys. Tomorrow, we will do a face cam stream. We'll do our Timu order haul um, because I know that I, I want to show everybody what we got. Um, and maybe my other packages will be here by tomorrow, too. So with that being said, I am going to go try and get Nissa to calm down. Um, so she goes to bed. And I am sorry to cut it short. But y'all know Nissa is the most important. So I love you guys. Have a great night. I will see you all tomorrow. I'll be in Discord and Twitter and all that good fun stuff. And yeah. Okay. Bye. <laughs>